Hi everyone, it's Eric and in this video I'm going to show you how to watch 3D movie trailers on your Nintendo 3DS. Now, quick couple disclaimers. One, you can do this with any 3D video on YouTube, that's where we're going to basically be doing it. And it doesn't have to be just movie trailers, but that's the use I'll be using it for. And secondly, this only works on the new Nintendo 3DS consoles. Both the original sized new Nintendo 3DS and the new Nintendo 3DS XL. So, those are the two disclaimers, let's show you how to do it. Now one thing I'm going to tell you guys uh, to keep in mind, which is something that I would have thought would have worked, this crappy YouTube app does not support the 3D feature. This YouTube app is completely worthless and the web browser YouTube app is much better and actually uh, looks much better with quality on YouTube videos. So we're going to open the web browser and you're going to have to have your wireless enabled obviously. And what we're going to do is, as you can see, the YouTube is already loaded up. I have it pre-loaded uh, on my web browser. And the Nintendo 3DS does have a much better web browser than it previously did as the processor has been increased. Now, one thing you're going to have to do, as you can see, I've been watching a 3D trailer of uh, the James Cameron's Avatar. Now, just because you search for 3D videos, that doesn't necessarily mean it's going to work on this new Nintendo 3DS. What you're going to have to do is look for a specific type of 3D. Now, as you can see, the stereoscopic right, stereoscopic right here, that's the type we need to look for. So let's just do a quick example search. 3D, well, let's just uh, change that. Stereo 3D trailers. And let's hit submit. Now, as you can see, you need a, du a dual image, whether there's one, uh, one image at the bottom and one image on the top, or two images at the side like these, you're going to need two images, basically, in order for this to sort of work uh, properly. So, let's just go to one very, very quickly. I'm just going to go to one that I think has the least amount of copyright going on. Just for a very quick uh, sort of like demonstration, we'll go into 3D TV Grand Canyon right here. And what you can do is press play and the video is about to load at the top. Now, one thing I'm going to tell you to do is that you can, first of all, you've got your various options here, and these are really nice sort of like controls to actually watch your videos. What you have to do is click on 3D display, and here you have a whole bunch of 3D options. Now, this has already enabled 3D for me. As you can see, if I press reset, it goes back to the two options, but it automatically tries to find the correct setting for you. So this is the one that is selected. You can do little comparisons yourself with these to see which one looks better, but normally it does tend to get the right option. Put your 3D slider up, and then you'll be able to see this in 3D, and yes, I can see this in 3D, and it does look quite nice. The only problem, however, and this is something that I'm pretty certain every 3DS owner is aware of, Whenever it comes to videos or cutscenes, the 3D is set. Normally you have to adjust the 3D to a comfortable level. Mine is just below the halfway point. But the thing is, whenever you're watching videos, there, there is no uh, sort of like sweet spot for actually controlling the 3D. Even if you have it halfway, even if you have it just a tad bit lifted, the 3D is maxed out by default. So it's not too ideal, because the effect is definitely there, but it's not the best for people like me because I can't really cope with the 3D on its full setting. On some games I can, but on videos in particular, for some reason, the 3D is much more aggressive with your eyes. So, just something to keep in mind, it's more, you don't want to do any 3D movies or anything yet, Nintendo really do have to perfect this more, but when I did get a 3DS, my, the original 3DS, all those years ago, I wanted this sort of feature uh, enabled on it, I wanted to watch 3D uh, trailers or movies, and is they've, they have, they've got there now, they've half, I'd say they're, they're not fully there, but they've definitely got a massive step forward with this, and that is an absolutely wonderful, fe fun wonderful feature, and I thought I'd let you guys know about it, because Nintendo did not really advertise this feature with the new Nintendo 3DS, so that's very strange, but I thought I'd bring it to your attention. So that's it for this quick video, thank you guys very much for watching, I really do appreciate it. Please click that subscribe button you can see on your screen right now, and you will be updated with my latest videos. Thank you very much for watching guys, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Take care.